Baby Your Baby is brought to you in part by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Welcome back. We all know that you shouldn't smoke when you're pregnant, but what about after the baby is born? We have registered nurse Katrina Jensen here from Intermountain Moms. Thanks for stopping by today. So what effects does smoking have on newborns? We've heard before that secondhand smoke is awful for anyone, but what about yeah. newborns specifically? Well, you know, Ron, newborns have little tiny lungs, and yeah. there's over 4,000 chemicals in secondhand smoke, and over 50 are known to cause cancer. But really, when you think about your baby and smoking, you want to, asthma comes to mind. I mean, kids have more ear infections. There's more SIDS, which is a tragic death of, mm -hmm. a, of a newborn, obviously. There's more upper respiratory infections. Um, they even can have more tooth decay. I mean, there's a whole array of things that happen. And it so, triggers, yeah. Yeah, so it's pretty, it's pretty important to think about the kinds of environments your kids are in. First of all, if you're smoking, you know, try to quit. And Nurse Danny a couple weeks ago talked about quitting during smoking and it's on the website and there's all kinds of help to quit smoking. But even if you've quit smoking during your pregnancy, the recidivism rate or the reoccurrence of smoking is something I wanted to touch on as well because yes, it's, very difficult. It yeah. it's very difficult to stay stopped smoking. I mean, it's such an addictive habit that we know that it's very difficult. So we, we yeah. know that and that's important to keep in mind. And here are some tips on the screen right now. If, you know, the best thing to do is just quit keep your kids from places that have smoke, make the home smoke free, get a babysitter who doesn't smoke, and encourage tobacco free child care and schools. Yeah, when you think about places that your kids are in the car with people that smoke and child care, these are all places that kids can be, even if you're not smoking necessarily, but to be aware of that, so super important. Yeah, and you would think, uh, after all the education that we have, that there wouldn't be that much of it going on now. Yeah, I think, I always keep in mind that smoking is a highly addictive habit yeah. and it is really difficult to quit and I've never been a smoker but I have a lot of empathy for people who have sure. started this habit at a young age. It's very difficult to quit but it's super important to keep trying and never give up. Okay. So. Well, uh, Katrina, thank you very much for Thanks, stopping Ron. by. For more information, where's a good source? On KUTV and then Intermountain Moms. So okay. we'll All be right. back in a couple weeks. Okay. We'll look forward thank to that. Thank you. Okay. Mary, back to you.